The Clough Lake Mine, located in northwest Saskatchewan, over 850 kilometers north of Saskatoon, on Treaty 8 territory and the homeland of the Métis, is owned by Orano Canada. The mine operated from 1980 through to 2002 when it was officially shut down after 22 years of production. At its peak, the Clough Lake operation counted about 300 employees. Over half were residents of northern Saskatchewan. The mine site included four open pit mines and two underground mines. There was a mill complex to produce uranium, several buildings such as warehouses, a water treatment plant, a tailings management area to manage waste, the germane camp to house employees, and an airstrip to bring employees and supplies to the site. Although uranium was the primary product, Clough Lake also produced gold from 1984 to 1988. After Clough Lake stopped producing uranium concentrate in 2002, it took a couple of years of planning and environmental assessment before the bulk of the physical decommissioning could be done between 2004 and 2006. The decommissioning planning process included intensive public engagement, and the ultimate land use plan identified by community members heavily influenced the design of the plan. The physical decommissioning work included backfilling the clode pit and planting local trees and grass. Every part of the site was decommissioned. For example, the tailings management area, or TMA, was drained, covered with local glacial till, contoured, and also planted with grasses native to the area. The waste rock piles were also reclaimed. The underground mine entrances were securely closed off and blended into the surrounding environment. The mill complex was demolished. Some of the mill equipment was repurposed to other mine sites and the remainder was disposed of in the former Clod open pit before it was backfilled. The last facilities to be dismantled were the Germain camp and the warehouse, which were used until 2013 by environmental monitoring and exploration crews working near Clough Lake. Some of the kitchen appliances, housing, and emergency response equipment were transferred to nearby communities. Today, all of the demolition work is complete, all culverts have been removed and the streams restored. And in all, over half a million trees and shrubs have been planted on the site. As part of the decommissioning plan, Orano implemented environmental and radiological monitoring activities with a focus on long-term groundwater and surface water quality. On-site water monitoring indicates that metal concentrations meet the water quality objectives established for the site, and the findings are reported to provincial and federal regulatory agencies. Following a public hearing with the Canadian Nuclear Safety Commission, the license for the Clough Lake project was revoked and the site was cleared for transfer to the province of Saskatchewan through the Institutional Control Program. The site will continue to be monitored by the province through funding provided by our company, Arano. This transfer is possible because federal and provincial regulators are confident that the site is safe and stable for the long term. Today, access to Clough Lake is no longer restricted. It is safe for the public to use the area. However, travel on site requires 4x4 vehicles as the area continues to be reclaimed by nature to regain its full boreal forest state. Our environmental monitoring results demonstrate that it is safe for people to use the site for traditional purposes, such as hunting, fishing, gathering, or trapping. The Institutional Control Program is designed to protect the public from the costs associated with closed mines. Under this program, Orano is responsible for providing funding for the continued monitoring, potential maintenance, and unforeseen events at the site in the future. The Clough Lake site has been responsibly managed by Orano and its predecessor companies from cradle to grave. From exploration through operations and decommissioning, all the activities were planned, assessed, and approved considering the health and safety of workers and the public, as well as the protection of the environment. There has been no loss of continuity in the responsibility for or oversight of this site. The decommissioning has achieved an end state where land restrictions are minimized 
decommissioning features require only passive care and the site is available for traditional land use. In short, in Saskatchewan, Clough Lake resembles no other uranium site which has undergone or is undergoing decommissioning to date. The Clough Lake mine is considered to be one of the first modern uranium mines to be decommissioned this way in Canada. Nature is slowly reclaiming the Clough Lake site. The wildlife has returned and plants are growing, helping formerly developed land blend into the existing landscape. Someday, future generations may not even realize that long ago, this area was a hub of industrial activity.